Hello and welcome to episode 52 of my Planet Explorers tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on trying to do the quest Negotiate with the Puja. I say trying because that's exactly what's happening to me. I'm having a trying time. Um, let's explain why. Well, you remember in the last episode, I was so happy that I made my aircraft, wooden aircraft again, because the last one got blown up mysteriously by aliens. Um, so I made another one and I was all happy and ended that episode. But when I started this episode and went to use my plane, my wooden plane, you'll notice I don't get any options to board it or use it or anything. So it's like it's there purely for show. It's playing with my little wooden aeroplane robot. They're, they're happy together. But the trouble is, of course, it's no good to man or beast because you can't use it. And I've been all over it before some of you start saying, try it from the other end, try it from the middle, try it from the wing. And I've pushed it all over this place. And as for the fleet, well, what can I say? Just take a look at that one there and that tells you everything people walk into them and just walk them to the walls this one's got knocked off the top so it's just like it's been drinking anyway do i care no not at all i just want to go and try and do this next quest trying being the word so i've made another plane another wooden plane maybe i should make a paper one i'd have more luck with that perhaps but anyway i've made another wooden plane and i'm going to see if i get out of this area because i think they're all associated with the fleet these aircraft I've built and so they don't allow me to use them but maybe if I wander far enough away if we have a look at the map I've got to go all the way there so let's teleport to there and then put down my plane and see if it will actually work yeah I couldn't believe it I was so happy I'd made my plane and then when I went to use it I couldn't use it it's like it's like uh, my settlement, my colony had claimed it for the fleet because one of their ships got destroyed. Like, that's my fault. I mean, I'm only the sucker who's building all these planes. The least it could let me do is use one of them after making five of them like that. Anyway, so here we go on the sixth plane. Let's see if I can actually use it. At least my wooden plane's working. Trouble is, I can't jump on it to fly around with it. So I'm presuming it's going to attack, at least I hope it is, uh, attack the enemies. If it don't, that's the next bit of fuel for my fire. Anyway, so let's not talk harshly about my wooden robot. Let's put down my plane and see if I can use it. I can, cool. There we go, all's forgiven. So let's get on. Now I've just got to try and remember how to fly it. Oh yeah, space bar goes up. Oh, look at my crew members, happily sat in the wooden plane. I hope none of them's got matches. Okay, let's check the map. And what direction am I going in? I haven't got a clue. So, ah, oh, follow the blue arrow there. So, I need to turn it around a little. And fly in this direction. Never have I played a game where so many negotiations have ended in hostilities. And I know it's usually my side which does the attacking, but you know, it's an irony. It says negotiate, but what it's really saying is go shoot the uh, out of the aliens, or the aliens are gonna the crap out of you. So either way, it's not negotiating. Here we are. Oh. Yeah, we have their attention. Here we go. Let's wait for the missiles and the bullets to start flying. Okay, so I've flown too far. I didn't want to fly into the area, but let's get down on the ground. If I can remember how. Oh, I can. It's the AWP key. Oh, I think I'm going to crash at this speed. Oh, a bit too fast. But my wooden plane's okay. It can handle it. Okay, down you go. And let's now see if I can get out of it. Oh, I have to do this quest update. Oh, what did the other planes come with us? I can't see them. Is 
is the bomb ready? See? See? What did I say? Negotiations and already is the bomb ready. So what sort of negotiations is that? I mean, I always associate associ um, negotiations with peace, but he's already got his negotiations worked out. Anyway, let's carry on. Pack it. Oh, so they've dropped a bomb already. We ain't even got to talking. We'll see what they're going to do. We better get out of here quick if they play hardball. Yeah, right, so I'm still waiting to try and get out my aircraft. All oh, right, yeah, so it's the E key to get out. Okay, let's get it back. Because me likes me wooden plane. And now I've got a quest marker over here. So I've got to go to that. So let's run, save a little time. Or, in fact, how far have I got to go? Not far. It'll help if I eat. Here we go. Now, are they going to start firing at me? Or is someone on my side going to drop a bomb? We'll see. Right, wait for the others to get here. And then it should update. There we go. Well, they're not shooting yet. No, maybe it's because they know we've got a big bomb. Time to see if Ava and Peter's worked paid off. How do you know our language? Ah, interesting. That's better. Why goes it better? You should have just wiped them out. They are nothing. Why does it matter? We should just wipe them out. They are nothing. Ah, so the lope well, let's just call him Dopey Do. Uh, this guy, isn't it? He's the aggressive one. Oh no, he's the aggressive one over there, Dopey. Oh, they're getting into position. They're surrounding us. Now it's saving. Why are you here, Sky People? Are you silly beings called forth by the Pujan nation? Yeah, okay, maybe it isn't silly, but I'll fill in the blanks. Why did you attack? We are not related to the Pujan. We come in peace from far away. Yeah, that sounds like good. Come in peace. You damage our sacred site. You attacked our... Lots of our people. Um, maybe that one's a swear word, but I'm not going to say it up our resources and build many things on our land. You call that peace. We see through your lies. Well, you know what? We've always lied. Goes right back in antiquity. Thousands of years. Since we learnt to walk, we also learnt to lie. Deal with it. No, we're not going to go for aggressive. We meant no harm. We just thought you wouldn't mind us building all over your land, just like we've done in every nation across the world, different civilizations. That's exactly what we do. We just go and build. And if the neighbours don't like it, well, there you go. It is what it is. We don't want to fight you. We even offered you a tribute. A few mouldy bananas, I think we offered them, or fruits. Oh, we've also got a bomb to offer you, but that's another conversation, I think. Uh, anyway, so let's choose this. Saying that with a straight face, either killing so many of our brethren, you take us for fools. Ah, saying that with a straight face after killing so many of our brethren, you take us for fools. Oh, this ain't going well. Quiet sky person. We are not...
something to send blood but you left us no choice with our reactions the central forests were pivotal to our economy and defense you supply oh for goodness sake this is like a game in itself you something supply took is from no that can't be right something from is i'm sure he's just swearing at me pieces of fruit oh yeah that must be the offering we gave you supply moldy pieces of fruit uh, we want you to leave as soon as possible there you go i translated it so it's not good We didn't know it was your land, but we need a place to stay. I'm saddened it's come into this, but we cannot accept that. Not when we're in a position of strength. Then there's nothing more to say. Let us decide this on the battlefield. No, wait a minute, I'm not ready. We ain't got the bombs here, so we can't decide it just yet. Let me just go and make a cup of coffee, and we can drop the bombs, and then that can decide it for us. Are you sure you want to walk away? You are not in you are in no position to dictate to us on any terms. Be gone. Are you sure you want to fight us? Let me give you a simple demonstration of our power. Ah. Here you go, bomb time. Oh yeah, that is really cool. Look at that. Nothing like impressing the neighbours with a giant mushroom cloud. So, they're probably going to turn around and say to us, Well, you think that's something? Check this out. And they'll probably send an even bigger bomb now to our colony. That does look impressive. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Yeah. That indeed was a good bomb, Adissa. That is really cool. What in that? Yep, that got your attention, didn't it? We did not wish to fight you. We still don't. We are willing to put the past behind us. But I promise you that if you hurt any more of our people, we will show you no mercy. If we do not negotiate a peace, we will use that on you. You speak peace, yet you carry God's ire. Or fire. One of the same. Um, okay, here we go. Got more translate. Uh, and I'm going to have words with the person that was supposed to have translated all this out. Because I'm not too impressed with them. Something... Even if you have that, you are but a few. We will st still win. I was going to say something else then. That may be true, but is it worth the cost? Getting rid of a threat such as you may well be worth it. I have seen you bleed, little man. Ooh. Ah, at last, some sense. You are the one who came to our land. Sky people. You obviously are resourceful. We don't want to fight you. It is not worth our energy. As we have been in a war with... Pujans for a long time. However, you cannot expect us to give just expect us to just give you the forests. Who wants the blinking forest? I don't. Oh, I got an achievement. World peace. There's a first. 
Oh, and there's the timer. But you know what? I'm having fun translating, so let's continue on. I'm probably messing up half the sentences. Um, ah, there you go. We are only here temporarily. We are going to the northern continent, where they probably claim the oceans. You wait, you watch. As soon as I say this, they'll say, well, what about the other half of the forest? That's there. That... That... May be so, but we... How long... You will be... Oh... We cannot dig our cut lumber what will you be on our lands. We do not want to fight you, but we will if we must. Okay, so someone tell me whether they're angry or they want peace. Do they want fight? War or peace? I ain't got a clue here. Good job I don't go on any negotiations. Well, none like this game does, because I should have a rocket grenade in my pocket to pull out and say, we come in peace as I shoot it at them. Uh, uh, we come in peace, you go in pieces. Anyway, let's carry on. The elder is speaking in tongues. Yeah, I'd say that again, all right. I don't understand this tongue. Chill. You're here. You're disrupting our economy and defence. We want some compensation. Okay, we'll give you more mouldy fruit. It's not a problem, really. Seriously, it's not. We can, I can go back to my colony and they'll grow you a thousand rotten turnips or whatever the fruit is you have here. What do you want? We want access to iron and timber. We have seen you pluck them up from the earth as at incredible speeds. Ah, I assume you want, I assume you want your captured friends back. We will release them as a goodwill gesture. Oh, nice. Yes, we want our people back intact. We also want the person David slapped. There's no way we will give you any weapons, but we are willing to trade iron and timber with you. Ah, so he's warned them of us, and he was telling the truth, sadly to say. Unless you give us weapons. Huh? You fool. Who's a fool, me? Or that nasty one? That can be arranged. What, <clears throat> that we are a fool, or we can gonna give them weapons? You just said you aren't going to give them weapons. Make your mind up. We will consider it. Let us talk amongst ourselves for a bit. Yes, you just go and jolly well do that. I'm going to just go over here and talk to Michael. See if he's got another bomb. Because I think we'll be needing it. No, don't go walking off. Wow, am I being sarcastic if I said that went well? Um, well, in actual fact, you know what? That is my nature. So I'm going to be sarcastic. That went well. I'm not fighting yet. So that's progress. Shit. I think that bomb really worked in our favor. Whatever Sly told them didn't know we were able to make a fusion bomb. I think we will end up getting most of what we want, which is peace. Yeah, that's good. I like that. Uh, let's talk to him again. Yeah. What you got in your shop? Anything that I care to purchase? No. Okay. Let's, no, don't go running off. What's the matter with you? We're in the middle of negotiations. What do you think of these three? I think the one called Oiki is a serious hawk. Dopey. We should be wary of him. The elder and the other guy seemed pretty wise, though. Thank goodness. We have decided not to give you the... I think that means something or other, but I'm not going to say it. Oh, wait a minute. No, it doesn't. We have decided not to give you... The guy, something David. We will, however, let you talk to him. We also want 3,000 units of iron and 3,000 units of timber uh, as the condition for peace. 
I thought his name was David Sly, so oh, wait a minute. We have decided not to give you the Sly person, David. Yeah, that's probably a good way of putting that. Right, so they want 3,000 of each. Well, you know what choice have we got? Have I got 3,000 on me? I hope so. We agree to these terms. From now on, we will no longer attack any of you sky people unless attacked yeah well that's fair enough we do want access to the forest fine you can have the whole blinking forest for all i care i just want my wooden plane we also demand that you do not help the pujan pajan in any way in our war i don't even know who's who so you know what as long as you don't shoot bullets at us that's Fine with me. Reasonable. Agreed. There you However, go. We reserve the right to have a diplomatic relationship with them. Uncivilized savages. Do what you will as long as we're not targeted. But I warn you, we will be watching. Ooh. We want our people released unconditionally right now. I'll see to it. Where is it that you say people from come from? We have many questions. Sky person David refused to answer some of our questions. Yeah, right. Because he don't want us to get annihilated on our home planet. Some are very far away. We would also like to learn more about you. We would like to set up a meeting among scholars to exchange some information. That is a possibility. So, here they come. We treated them well at per sly person David's request. Weird the way he says that. Anyway, they're aliens, so what do I know? Okay, oh, I've got to talk to Michael again. Right, it's night time. Time to sleep so we can actually see what we're doing, for goodness sake. Uh, don't mind me sleeping in the middle of your negotiations. I'm sure they will help if we can see each other's face. Today is a great day to go on an adventure. It certainly is, whoever you are. Oh, look, they're all having to sleep now. I wish it would stop saving and just get on with it. Well, it looks like we've got David... As Lenoff back, and that's good. Okay? They didn't hurt you. I think he's got a good shot. We're okay. Thank you for releasing them. I'm glad we've come to an understanding today. We will send over the resources right away, and I hope we don't come to any more conflict in the future. Sky person here will be our envoy to your people from now on. Go oh, right, Sky Person Gangster will be the envoy who gets shot at and bullets and bombs and everything dropped on. Nothing new there then. We understand. We will welcome Sky Person Gangster as a special guest. Now to complete our agreement, we'll need a, a trial of blood. Oh, here we go. I knew it was too good to last. And what is that? They don't even know what that is. Oh, look, they're going to start getting all arrogant now with us. Both parties of the agreement will need to... ...eat an offering, since that agreement scope is significant. The offering will need to match... Here will be our representative. Oh, that person will be here. Will be our representative. Who will be your representative? Oh, let me guess. Here we go. Got to now eat a load of food. Okay. At least we're not fighting each other. What do you think? Yeah, that's it. Because you know I can't say no. I'll see. Look, I said I can't say no. I'll do it. Yeah, here you go. So I'm the envoy, the representative. I'm everything, basically. Good. Release the offering. Oh no, they're going to release it. That means I've got to eat it raw. Oh, how worse can this get? I think I better end this episode soon.
Show me what you've got, Sky Person. Oh, here we go. So we're going to fight or something. I don't know. Seal the deal. Oh, great. Look at the size of that thing. Let's get my bed back. And let's turn the sound down. So here's the offering. This is what I've got to do. Why is there a quest giver there with them? So we got to fight this thing. And it looks tough. Good job. I've made myself some sentry guns. you got to love these sentry guns. Look at that. Check these out. You know I always say this. I love them the bits. Put them all in a neat line. Oh, look at that. Yeah, look at his energy go down. There you go. You are worthy. So that was the offering. <laughs> I thought it was just some creature roamed by too close. Uh, our peace agreement is now settled with blood. We will honour it as long as you honour it. Well, knowing the human race, that should be all of five minutes. Um, thank you. We will now return to our base. We will send our envoys, envoys soon with the resources. Come on, let's get back to the colony. Roger that. Let's head back, everyone. Oh, and guess who's going to probably have to gather all the resources? Yep, me. Sky Person Gamester. That's who. But that's okay, I can do that off camera. It's like I'm the only person living on this planet, the way they assign everything to me. I wonder if there's a, um, a time limit on how quickly I've got to give them the resources. Okay, let's go get this loot from that creature pay for the energy that I had to use and let's now teleport back as quick as I can and at least I've got somewhere I can teleport to there now so let's head back in fact you know what I better end the episode here I don't even know how long I've been recording but I've been enjoying it Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.